Hi guys, welcome to my channel Mother's Flavor. My name is Nikita and I'm really sorry about my voice. I'm not keeping well so you know uh, you might feel there is slight difference in it. Today's recipe is a sambar recipe and it is very easy to do recipe and it is tomato sambar. Here I am blanching the tomatoes and then using it. If you don't have the time you can just chop the tomatoes and as well use it and just cook it till it becomes soft. So to make our uh, tomato sambar we will be needing the following ingredients. Firstly I have taken about 1 tablespoon of uh, ghee. If you want you can even use oil. Half a teaspoon of hing, 1 teaspoon of uh, rice or mustard seeds. 1 tablespoon of sambar powder. This is homemade sambar powder. How to do this uh, sambar powder at home? The video is there in the description box below. If you don't have sambar powder, then just add chilli powder and add 1 tablespoon of dhania powder and 1 tablespoon of garam masala. 4 cloves of garlic which I have crushed. Half tablespoon of uh, garam masala, one teaspoon of dhania powder, salt to your taste, tomato puree. Uh, I have actually taken about four tomatoes. I have boiled it in water. Basically, I have blanched it in water and taken out the skin of it and then put it into our blender jar and made a fine puree of it. So, to make uh, tomato sambar, first we will heat a pan or then in this we will add in our uh, ghee. As soon as our ghee melts, we will add in our uh, mustard and jeera. Once our uh, mustard and jeera starts crackling, we will add in the ghee. Once that's done, then we will add in our uh, crushed garlic. Saute this. Once it starts turning uh, brown in color, we will turn our heat to full low. Then add in our dhania powder, garam masala powder, and our samba powder. Once it will we'll add in our uh, tomato. We'll add some water to this. Then add the water using that is left out uh, from the blanching of the no tomatoes if you want to. Ambar will need some more water. Add in some salt to taste. We will turn it to medium. This sambar boiled really well for about 5 minutes with the lid closed. So now our sambar has been simmering down for about 5 minutes. So now we will just take out the lid. Now it's done. So we we'll just turn off our heat. Now we'll just transfer this into our uh, serving bowl. We'll just uh, garnish it with some uh, coriander leaves. So there you go. Our uh, tomato sambar is ready. I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. If you really like the video, then do hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel. And do hit the bell icon to get the notification of all the videos. Thank you.